For over 90 years, the citizens of Kokedo have recognized the importance of collecting and preserving the history of the city and the surrounding area. This year, 2021, marks an important milestone in this long-standing tradition, the 45th anniversary of the opening of the current museum building. It may surprise some residents to know that the museum actually predates the current museum building. The museum was originally founded in 1928 thanks to the efforts of Charles R. Peterson and Henry Clay Bull. Through their labors and Bull's funding of $25,000, the H.C. Bull Library Building was constructed at the Cocado Public School. The mezzanine floor was initially converted into the museum space, but as the collection continued to grow, it was moved into the basement level. For many years, the H.C. Bull Library and Museum remained a cooperative building between the city and school district. Around 1974, the city of Cocado, at the request of the school, relinquished its influence over the H.C. Bull Library. The decision prompted a search for a new residence for the public library and museum collection. On October 14, 1974, the community of Cocado voted in favor of the erection of the library museum building. On December 23, 1974, the Cocado Historical Society was incorporated with the purpose of working in conjunction with the city of Cocado in the collection, preservation, and interpretation of the history of Cocado. The first Cocado Historical Society Board of Trustees included Janice Severson, Edry Swanson, Gordon Bergstrom, Carl Harkman, Michael Ackerman, Carlton Lee, Renette Doring, Barbara Borseth, Ronald Ostray, Gordon Olson, and Bruce Peterson. The city of Cocado hired an architect and the planning began. On February 1975, the site of the new building was acquired on 4th Street in Millard. The total cost of the project was $204,000. Groundbreaking ceremonies were held on Sunday, September 14, 1975. In 1976, John Martinson was named the first director of the Cocado Museum and played an integral role in the construction of the exhibits in the museum. Under his direction, the Cocado Museum integrated the original museum collection from the H.C. Bull Library into the new displays. In August and September of 1976, volunteers pulled long hours transporting by hand the artifacts from the H.C. Bull Memorial Library building to the new museum. They also worked on deassembling and reassembling the Pioneer Cabin that had once sat out in Peterson Park. The museum's success is due to the many years of cooperation and support from the Cocado Historical Society, City of Cocado, staff, and countless volunteers. It is truly a community effort. Please stop into the Cocado Museum and see what we have to offer. We look forward to your visit!